wrench. Here we go, starting off CNC break number 11,244. We've got the black diamond. Practice what you preach. That's what it is. Thank you. And as I said, our members should know more of how we are and that I would obviously not go into someone's room and try to start commotion. I'm not going to win. I know that, number one. Jeremy Roenick for the LA Kings. That is like knowledge trolling 101. You're not going to convince other people. We've got a gemography of Chris Draper. But in all honesty, again, guys, I do appreciate those who did notify me and let me know. Golden, I know you were one of them who helped me out in that. I do appreciate this very much. So you guys should know how we are. And if you guys do see that, I do appreciate you guys notifying us. Keith Yando, triple diamond for the Coyotes. Stop touching that wrench. That was some of the lines in those movies are amazing. The one I almost died at a couple days ago was the uh, Double Diamond Brad Boys for the Boston Bruins. I was watching Dumb and Dumber, and I was near the end when I can't remember the guy's name was it uh, Her uh, Harry when he got shot. We've got a Quad Diamond rookie gem of Noah Welch for the Penguins, and then I think. Uh, well, the Jim Carrey's character was like, what if we shot you in the face? Oh, man. Triple Diamond Dion Phaneuf for the Calgary Flames. Absolutely love that line. And, like, just look at his face. Like, yeah, what if you shot me in the face? That was a risk we were willing to take. Double Diamond of Hemsky for the Oilers. Too funny. We've got a quad diamond for the Boston Bruins, Cam Neely. We've got a Federov Columbus Blue Jackets. How many people remember him on Columbus? Triple diamond of Bergeron. You're watching Old Walking Dead. I haven't seen the last two seasons, I think. So, nobody spoil that for me. Patrick Thorson for the Edmonton Oilers. We've got a base. Double Diamond of Jaguar. But Noble, I do appreciate it in, uh, in none of my screenshots that I see you bashing me. Maybe it was not in the screenshots. Who knows? But I do appreciate it. <laughs> Mike Romero for the Montreal Canadiens. We've got a Bill Guerin for the Dallas Stars. Single jersey. You've got no dog in the fight. I know. Blows my mind how many people are just blind, right? Roberto Luongo for the Vancouver Canucks. That is what I have been on the same pace. Constantine Pushkinov, rookie gems, triple diamond for the LA Kings. Like, as I said, literally we had an upper deck person in our room that night. It's not a good look when anyone goes into your room and uses your name as a troll account. Double diamond of Ryan Miller. You're, and you already have a bad record with Upper Deck. It's, you're not going to win that battle. It's not my problem. Don't go into my room when there's an Upper Deck person in there. That's probably the easiest thing to do. Or just don't do it. Sorry. That would be the easiest thing to do. So... But, as I said, not the first time I've been blamed. It won't be the last time I get blamed. Oh my God, it is hockey cards, man. Hockey card drama. I gotta, you know what I could do? Create one of those TV shows, like The Storage Wars or something, right? Where people are still crazy. Just, just a manufactured card drama. 
You said what about my company? Double diamond of J.P. Dumont for the Nashville Predators. We could definitely get some cool characters in this industry. Premier cut of Scott Niedermeyer for the Anaheim Ducks. And I feel like that's what made the Tiger King. The Tiger King thing, like the best thing, is the characters are just mind blowing. Double diamond of Timu Solani for the Anaheim Ducks. Double diamond of Patrick Sharp for the Hawks. Uh, we got a Ruby of uh, Josh Harding, number to 100. Uh, oh, do these guys ever approach you? You know what's funny? So most dealers always go to us for problems. And I'm not trying to say that in a good or bad way. Most dealers go to us for, like, the problems. Premier cuts of Lungfist for the Rangers because we have a bigger voice. So I have no problems taking the burden and taking charge on some things. Double Diamond of Marty Turco for the Dallas Stars. We've definitely had some guys who... You know, they walk by us and they, like, they kind of give you, like, a little middle finger or something. Patrick Hornquist, Ricky Gems, Triple Diamond for the Preds. Um, and as I said, 99, oh, I would pretty much guarantee every single person that doesn't like us, if you actually ask them the reason, and if it's a legit reason, it's probably not legit. Gemography, Marco Sturm for the Boston Bruins. It just, as I said, people will sometimes blindly follow you know, what, what they hear and go, oh, it must be true. Rookie Gems Quad Diamond, Blake Wheeler for the Boston Bruins. Somebody said uh, Blake Wheeler might have been number two. We got it. But, yeah, so nothing too nothing too bad on uh, Nick Lidstrom, Triple Diamond for the Red Wings. White, I, I, I've been offered to, to go outside and have a fight with somebody once. That was fun. Only happened once, though. So. I did not fight him. I can tell you that. Absolute waste of time. We got a rookie gems triple diamond of John Filowich. Double diamond of Sam Gagne. I don't you might have actually been at the party that he was at the one time. Might have been. Quad jersey of Gilbert Brule for the Oilers. Quad Diamond, Alex Ovechkin for the Caps. Rookie Gems, Triple Diamond of Tom Sestito for the Blue Jackets. Tom Sestito. We've got a whole whack of base. We've got a quad jersey of Bergeron. For the Boston Bruins. And triple diamond of Kippersoff for the Calgary Flames. Alright, uh, the Steakhouse and... Okay, so it wasn't that one then. Yeah, so you were not at that one then. Okay. Double diamond of Mike Madonna. And we've got a quad jersey of Datsuk for the Red Wings. Babel Datsuk for the Wings. Uh, sure. Uh, any advice for new breakers? Yeah, follow the rules that Upper Deck sets, because if you make Upper Deck your enemy, you're not winning that battle. That is, that is literally just like business 101. Upper Deck, like, again, even for me, Upper Deck can shut me down if they truly wanted to. They can just say we're done, move on, and that's it. There's no point of arguing against them in terms, like, you can talk to them, of course. I'm not saying they're bad people. Gemography, Mark Fraser for the New Jersey Devils. But if you want to, like, try to rebel against them, you will not win. Do things the right way, things will go your way. Double Diamond of Luke Shen for the Maple Leafs. If you want to be a rebel, well, deal with the consequences then, right? Rookie Gems, Triple Diamond of Byron Bits. Like, I just don't understand the logic. Like, 
You know, some people use the words like, okay, you suck up. Okay, well, go to your boss and tell them to screw off or something. See how that goes for you. <laughs> Unfortunately, you have to be good to them. Double Diamond Eric Stahl for the Carolina Hurricanes. We've got a quad jersey, Brandon Dubinsky. And, and realistically, it's like anything else in any industry. If you get cut or slashed or whatever, there's a reason why. It's not magically happening because people don't like you. There's a reason why. Triple Diamond Rookie Jams of Taylor Chorney for the Oilers. And a goal for the Maple Leafs number to 10, Matt Station. <laughs> She's not normal. Well, then you have one of the good ones. Triple diamond for the Jets of Ilya Kovalchuk. So that would be my advice card, man. Absolutely my advice. Do everything the right way and you'll be good. Pair with the right people. Be good with people in the industry. Creating storms with everyone will never work for you. I can promise you that. We've got a Lanny. This guy's all over tonight. Lanny McDonald. For the Toronto Maple Leafs squad jersey. Like, to me, it's a funny reminder, but it's like, uh, who's that guy who picked the fight with Eminem? Who's that guy? I can't remember. Double Diamond of Gagne. Machine Gun Kelly? Rookie Gems Quad Diamond, Tyler Bozak. Like, if you're going to go out there and gun against the people that are, like, the biggest in the industry, you're not going to do well. Rookie Gems of Michael Sawyer for the Rangers. And that's the thing, just, but the, be honestly, card band, just do the right things, listen, Bobby Ryan, double diamond for the Ducks, and a die cut of Luongo, quad diamond horizontal for the Canucks. And as I said, never be scared to ask for advice. Quad diamond of Marty Berger for the Devils, because contrary to belief, I pretty much have talked to almost every single breaker before they started, and they've started, haven't they? Stan Makita, Triple Diamond for the Hawks. So, I clearly have no problems with people doing the right thing in opening stores. My track record shows it. Double Diamond of Benebo for the Habs. We've got a Ruby, number to 100 of Daniel Sabine for the Canucks. Double diamond of jewelry for the Rangers. The biggest thing, though, in all honesty also, is have the ambition to open up a card store. If you don't, it's going to be very tough for you. Triple diamond of Joe Thornton for the Sharks. As I've said, a lot of people are not aware. And this is also one thing that I really, really wish people understand clearly. I don't care who you join or what you join. If you join a break from a non-CDD, you are S-O-L if anything gets damaged. Upper Deck will only help out customers of CDDs. So if there is an issue with a product for us, an SP Authentic, for example, you will get covered by Upper Deck. Oh, yeah. That's fine. So, yeah. But if you guys join a Facebook group breaker or someone who's not a CDD, you literally are SOL. Triple diamond of Stastny. That is definitely a rule that a lot of people don't pay attention to or know, which is really annoying because that affects a lot of people. Like, imagine opening up, you know, a Quinn Hughes autograph and you can't do anything about it. It's damaged, you're screwed. Double diamond Cam Ward for the Carolina Hurricanes. Quad Diamond Stamkos for the Tampa Lightning. Rookie Gems Triple Diamond of uh, Maxime uh, Nero. Base. It is fair. Yeah, it is definitely fair. Double Diamond of Jury. But the amount of customers I've talked to that they joined other people's breaks and didn't realize that, like, they're screwed. They're honestly screwed. For the Islanders, John Tavares, and again, that's not a 
C and C rule or anything stupid. That is just an upper deck CDD rule. We've got a rookie gems quad diamond ruby Alexander Burmistrov to 100. But also, as this is recording, I want to make it abundantly clear: if anybody in the hobby is opening up a store, I will gladly help you. Shay Weber for the Preds. If you want to do breaks and do it properly, I will gladly help you. Gemography, James Van Riemsdyk for the Flyers. That's a good one. Why do people have this weird notion that I don't? Rookie Gems of Larson. Triple Diamond for the Dallas Stars. Rookie Gems, uh, Quad Diamond for the Islanders, Nino Niederreiter. Double Diamond of Kiprasov for the Calgary Flames. Quad Jersey of Ryan Miller for the Buffalo Sabres. Buffalo Sabres. Triple Diamond of Lungfist for the Rangers. We are going to be up in the wee hours tonight, aren't we, folks? <laughs> I feel it. Double Diamond of Doan for the Coyotes. Quad Jersey for the Coyotes of Ilya Brizgelev. Rookie Gems of Kyle Clifford for the LA Kings. I think it's at a different stage, Mike, and I don't think it'll ever be at the same stage it used to be. That's kind of cool. First one of these. we got a die cut. Team Canada. Mark Messier. I believe. What team do you play the most for? Die cut. Team Canada. Mark Messier. Was it Rangers you played the most for? Or Oilers? Or whatever. Or whatever team was. Carey Price for the Montreal Canadiens. Double Diamond. And we've got for the New Jersey Devils. Number to 1999. Matt Taramina. There we go.